Oh, oh, oh my god. Oh my god. You know what it feels like to take a tissue out of your nose that's been in there for an hour? Oh my god. It feels like someone's talking to me about their penis and all you can think about is... <laughs> Never mind. Um, so, you ready? Mm. Put the spaghetti oh, down. Oh god. Put it down. I'll hurt this baby. So yesterday? For Valentine's Day? What the fuck? Oh, that's not good. <laughs> Alright, we're good. Did you kick him? Nope. I just pretended to not be here. Alright, I'm gonna start it. Yeah. Well, there's nobody else here. So you're saying about Valentine's Day? Oh, yeah, yesterday for Valentine's Day, I made a lasagna. Oh. Do you know the proper way to make a lasagna? Layers. Describe to me everything you do to make a lasagna. Go. Well, I don't really... Starting from the, starting from the beginning, what would you do? I First... was like, I will give you $1,000 right now if you make me a really good lasagna. Okay, so you take the lasagna noodles... And then you throw them right in the trash, because who gives a shit about lasagna? You don't give a shit about lasagna, you give a shit about $1,000. Fine. $20,000. No, I'm not fucking Garfield. I don't give a You're shit about You're not making a lasagna for $20,000? Are you kidding me? No. Why? I don't care. Dude, I would, like, suck a dick for $20,000. Jesus. <laughs> what do you mean? How much money do you have? Not a lot, but you know what? I'm rich in spirit. You wouldn't. Oh God. <laughs> you wouldn't make a lasagna for twenty thousand dollars? Are I'd you kidding to, me? I'd have to think about it. You gotta be kidding me. I'd have to think about it. You gotta be shitting me right now. I was expecting you to say you're talking about spaghetti, and then the fucking Valentine's Day, I'm like, oh, you fucking had spaghetti with your girlfriend, and had a lady in the tramp moment. But you're like, no, and you start talking about fucking lasagna. Yeah, lasagna's your favorite food. Oh wow. Well. I guess it's kind of yours too, right? I mean, you I mean, just like pasta in general. Yeah. Yeah, no, we both love, uh, oh god. Oh my god. Do you guys both like Garfield? Wait, why do you- I've seen episode of Garfield. Why do you delete the- Those don't go that way. Yeah, they all come here. No, the air goes this way. What? No, they start here and then they go there. I don't believe you. Just gonna put it out there. I don't believe you. Fine. I should probably sell. Ah, uh, yeah, I'm gonna sell this for now. They're taking a different path. Oh, All right. So, can you tell me how you would cook a lasagna if you had to? <sighs> probably just use my mom's recipe. She uses Good like. Juice. I don't know. Start from the beginning. Ricotta cheese. Do you have to boil water? Yeah, you fucking make it like a normal lasagna, yeah. But uh, she That's did... what I'm asking. How is a normal lasagna made? Layers. You take the fucking. You make your stupid sauce, and you have the noodles in your pan, and you put the fucking noodles, and then you put. Do you like... boil the noodles first? Oh my god. I don't know. <laughs> you just have like raw pasta in the pan. Yeah. Okay. I heard it tastes a lot better that way. I don't know, what are you putting your fucking lasagna? Look, look where the air is. Look, they, they took a new path. You are garbage. I'm not wrong. <laughs> All right. But I'm not right either. I'll walk, I'll walk you through how, how to make lasagna. Please. Alright, so... Ooh, we need air towers. I put some up. Uh, genius. I only have number one. Oh, we have three up here. That's good. Alright, so, uh... First, oh, oh, what is that? Oh, there? I'm chilly. Oh yeah, I walked into one last time. They're not too good. That's silly. Okay, so you make your sauce. Yeah, that's, that's easy. On the side, you make your meat. Hold on, is so, it a meat sauce or no? I make the meat on the side first. Okay. So is I put. Is it ground beef? 
ground beef and sausage. Hmm. Like ground sausage. And then, once you cook that up, spice it up, pour that into the sausage you've been making. Uh, after you've done that, <laughs> um, you have to make a second sauce on the side. Yes. Which is, bless you. Um, Thank you. You put butter to a pan. Butter? Not like. Let the butter uh, melt and like turn slightly brown. You don't use Then spray? you add flour to it until it becomes like clumpy. And then you add milk until. It's all in low heat. You add milk until uh, it becomes like a white creamy sauce. Do you mind if people you try out your recipe? Pan. What? Do you mind if people try your recipe? No, go for it. Uh, this is a 100% stolen recipe, and it's delicious. Okay. So, I, I will not take credit for it, but it's amazing. Um, so yeah, you coat the pan in the sauce, and then the rest of the sauce that's remaining, you pour into your tomato sauce. And then you do your layers. Also, you um, boil water in a low heat, like a lower temperature boil, not like full high the stove maybe like a six or a seven um and you put the lasagna noodles in for just like 20 30 seconds each so they're not cooked they're just like slightly wet and then what and then you layer them with the with your meat sauce what if i you want put... cheese and spinach i don't do that i do uh mozzarella on top, or mozzarella and cheddar, or mozzarella and... Oh, you go bananas burgers. with the cheese. I like mozzarella cheddar, but you could do mozzarella, like, pecorino or mozzarella parmesan. The mozzarella is important, though, because it's that, it's that stringy cheese that you want on top. <coughs> uh, I hope you have a lot of shit, actually. Yeah, I hope you have, I have a lot no much, so No, I hope you have a lot of shit in the back. Five. It's a level 5 anti-air. Two of them, right? Or just one? We have one level 5 anti-air. You can hope that they come this way. Well, I can be oh my god, you see that? <laughs> yeah, it's not bad. Yeah, I don't think we need to worry about air anymore. I'm surprised you don't have a boner for fucking lasers. Fill the air. Yeah, I just, I don't have any money or gems, so here I am. So do you have any other recipes that I could take notes of? Uh, maybe we could do like one recipe. One, okay, we'll save it for the next, episode. yeah. Can we get a hint though? Is it another pasta dish? Is it a chicken? Um, Maybe something gluten free, vegetarian, you know? Ooh, got the this coins, dude. This coin. Oh, oh. Not in the water. It Where was not the in the water. Whatever, make a wish. It did just disappear. Yeah. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, shit. I hope those rock people die. <laughs> we need some cannons. Uh, yeah, probably my tomato sauce recipe, but not for lasagna. Lasagna tomato sauce is different. Yeah, let's save that. What do you think you make very well? Any sort of pasta dish. You think like a cucumber sandwich? Like something like that? Sounds easy as fuck. Mm. It's, uh, <laughs> it's a reference to something. I don't know. Oh fuck it, we'll Go mention grab it. Coins down there. So Tunkum, Tunkum has had a potluck, and he asked me the other day, he's like, "What should I make?" I'm like, I did this happen? Are you good at cooking? So, or so wait, let me let me give some more let me give some more uh, context. Yeah, go for it. Context here. So it was a going away party for one of my coworkers who just got another job at one of the other schools in our district. So she wasn't moving too far away and she got a promotion, so we were happy for her. Uh, she was staying in the district, so people weren't like salty about her 
taking a job at some other school or whatever. Okay, so everybody wrote down on the board what they were going to bring to the party. Did you really just build another into here? Yeah. I, we have two level fives back here. I know, but we can. And that one didn't even shoot these guys, and we have golems coming up. Yeah, I'm getting prepared for that. And spiders. Uh, so Finish your story. I need to hear it. I'm riveted. Okay. Oh, okay. Actually, I think they're gonna make it. Oh. Oh. oh shit, that was close. What? I. Where was I? Okay, so everyone wrote what they were going to bring up on the My board. Butthole tense up. And oh, some coins here. No, nope, you didn't. What's that? I think. Oh, that was just a bunch. Okay. Uh, yeah, and everybody was bringing sweet things. So we we're like, okay, we need some savory things. Dance what should we? Bring? Someone needs to bring savory, like something savory. It's like. Okay, I was thinking about it, I was thinking about it, I was like, hmm. You know what I could do? I could do... I could do like a taco bar. That was my idea. Okay. So I would just cook beef, and then bring in like hard shell tacos, and I could buy a tub of salsa, I could buy a tub of sour cream. Buy You're a, a hard shell water. person? No, but it's just easier. For like I a party like scene. Because so. they break and shit, you know? That's... I don't know. Honestly, I probably would have done both. Yeah. I'm, I'm but, certainly more of a soft shell person. Yeah, the hard but, hard shell people, they're kind of kind of weird. I mean, that's just what like we would eat in the school cafeteria. They're about to make it. Oh god. Oh god. We have a second level five back there. Holy shit. Can I stop being so close? Oh, I put put it at the back. That. So. Actually, maybe laser? Point. You're terrible at this, dude. I'm gonna build the laser, you save for uh, cannons if we need it. Anyway, so people, something savory, make yeah, a so list. So I needed something savory, so I was like, okay, I'll, I'll make a, like a taco bar. That would be pretty sweet to have. And then. As soon as I said that, one of my other coworkers was like, I was going to do nachos! Like... And we can't yeah, have I too many Mexican dishes, because this is you, the, I mean, this is America after all. This, this is America. This is, this is America. So... They're like, alright. I don't know, it's just like, you want different things. And those two dishes have a lot of the same ingredients in them. Yeah. I mean... Alright. So, I had no idea what to bring. So I asked Gangster Prankster here, and he comes up with a very clever idea of... Little sandwiches. That was not what we said. We said tiny sandwiches. It's the same thing. Not just little. Tiny. I said, you take sliced bread, and you cut into four quadrants. So you have the little, like, picnic-type sandwiches, and it's just easy finger food. People, you know... Nothing yeah. crazy. And he's like, yeah, you know so what? I went, I went for like the artisanal bread, so it didn't look as neat. Yeah, it looked awful. He sent me a picture. I might yeah. put the picture up if I can get it. <laughs> and then I just made a like meat and cheese plate with cucumbers uh, on the side. With all the bunch of the leftover stuff. Yeah. So can we? Uh, what were in these sandwiches? The most foul okay. sounding so the sandwiches meats, ever. It was a combination of the following. Okay. Smoked salmon. That's already a red flag, but. <laughs> Smoked salmon. Uh, salami. Hold prosciutto. on. When you go to Subway, do you order a fucking smoked salmon goddamn sandwich? No, I get meatball sub. Okay. Anyway, sorry to interrupt. Um. But I do love smoked salmon and cream cheese bagels. Sounds very millennial. No, just Jewish. Jesus. I can't say that. <laughs> Super. It's like the most Jewish food there is. Is it? Yeah. I don't know what Jewish people eat. 
smoked salmon, cream cheese, and bagels. Actually, bagels are supposed to be really big with Jewish people. Yep. Oh man. This is nerve wracking. Isn't it? No, we're good. This laser's Actually. just only hitting one. Terrible placement. Yeah. Still good, though. Money. So, cucumber, cream cheese, prosciutto, oh, yes. smoked salmon. Keep getting distracted. This is a hard story to tell. I know, it's, it's a lot. Ugh, I need one gold. It's been very <laughs> food oriented commentary. I do, I do like food. I'm a fan of food. You gonna build a arrow here? No. Oh, Huh? Apparently there's a coin over there. Oh, no, 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 no. Finish your story. There's a coin somewhere? Shit, it disappeared. Tell him to finish this fucking story, goddammit. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> okay. Uh, so. Eat some fish. Smoke salmon. Prosciutto. Ham. And salami. And then a mixture of cheddar, uh, pepper jack cheese, cream cheese. So like things that would taste good between those various. Look, this monster here made a fucking cucumber and cream cheese sandwich. Okay. Yes, one of them was a cucumber and cream cheese sandwich, and that is a thing. It's a real shit thing. I don't know. What? What made you think that was good? It's like a. It's like something you get at high noon tea. Like, how do you fuck up just turkey and cheese? I didn't... I don't want that. That's like the easiest. So lame. I did ham and cheese. Ham's fine, too. I did ham and cheese. I did... Uh, ham, cheese, and mustard. I did... I forgot about the mustard. Uh, I did... Did you do a mustard, up. cream He's cheese, and here. cucumber sandwich? What? Did you do mustard, cucumber, and cream cheese? Yeah, I had one of everything else, and the rest was that. You're a sick bastard. It was my favorite, so... Oh, you built a flame. I did. Nice, nice. What do you think? Oh, the tires are actually it's the shooting boss, him. right? Yeah. He's cool and blue. Actually, hold on. Let me see if I cannot fuck this up. Huh. What is he using? The flame kills these guys before they even spawn. There we you go. See that? I did not. But here we go. Nice. That didn't do anything. Yeah, it did. Sure didn't look like it. So that was cooking with Tunkum. <laughs> Coming to a uh, Barnes and Noble near you. Are we gonna leak? Okay, good. No, no, we're good. We're good. I was a little worried at the end when he was spawning those little guys. Yeah, I thought they were just gonna bum rush, but we actually did it. Yeah. Another fun level in the books.